I just filmed like 10 minutes of footage and then I realized I was just doing it in random order so I'm gonna spare you guys uh, the time and I'm just going to have a nice organized video here. To write a song, you're gonna need a notebook and a pencil. You're gonna also need an instrument, tape, and a highlighter or a Sharpie. I can find my Sharpie. I don't know how to play the piano, right? So I'm just gonna be like, okay, I like that note for my song. So I'm gonna put a little slice of tape on it and do a little coloring. You can also do sticky notes. That's how you're gonna mark your notes. So yeah. Okay, what I also like to do is basically set up like a video or just a voice memos um, recording of me just playing. So then every time I find a note or like a melody, I don't have to write the words down or anything. I can just replay the whole recording of me, you know, testing things out and then it's good to go again an instrument, a notebook, some tape, or sticky notes, and a pencil. But yeah, so you're gonna just kind of experiment and then say the most random words and sometimes they actually work out. But you wanna have a topic. So I have so, so many unfinished songs. Um, I have about 20, I actually have a song book. We'll come up with with the background music to a pre-written song is very very difficult so you don't want to already have the song written and then do the music i find it's so 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 much easier and so much more convenient to to do that was actually really good and okay so it's easier to come up with the music first and then kind of sing along to the flow of the music as you go. The second step of writing a song is to experiment with the music and then incorporate words relating to your topic into it and then you can just mark notes down. See I already made some notes um, but yeah make sure you mark your notes. You with the blurry eyes Guys, I see the light. I see the light. Damn it. Damn it. Another point I'd like to make is how when I am struggling with finding words that rhyme or like that relate to um, a certain topic or a certain text you want in your song. I like to just literally look it up. So in the next verse, I'm, I need a word that rhymes with disguise. <laughs> French fries. So it's literally so easy. You literally just look up some words you want and then you can get inspiration. Synonym, define this, define that. Words that rhyme with, you know, just use the internet. In the dark disguise, I see more than what's advertised. Come on in. stuck again but it's all good mesmerize
so sometimes, you know, you gotta have the lyrics there, so. You with the blurry eyes You in the dark disguised I see more than what's advertised When you do shy recognize Sweaty palms too shy to recognize So the previous uh, line was I see more than what's advertised And then right after it's Sweaty palms, too shy to recognize. See how that's way more syllables than the first one. So it doesn't really it doesn't really line up too well. So I'm gonna try to fix that a little bit, or maybe just add a little note on the side to incorporate. I said it again. To add it in the song later on. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you too. Shy to now. I'm just gonna see how it sounds. I'm trying to be quiet because I don't want anyone to hear. It's okay, you can hear. I'll be you with the blurry eyes, you with the saddest eyes. I see more than was ever thought you think you're too shy to be. Still don't like that and how you you see how i um i messed up on the lyrics but it doesn't really matter because i'm still kind of getting getting into the flow of things so i just carry on with the melody don't overthink it take your own advice queen anyway yeah try to be try to be less wordy i guess listen to grammarly this sentence is grammatically correct but it's wordy and hard to read Writing's not that easy, but Grammarly can help. This sentence is grammatically correct, but it's wordy and hard to read. Devil's eyes. I really like that, so I'm gonna make a little note over here. A um, little star at the top. Don't bother if it's messy. Just, just get your thoughts down. Basically, instead of you think you're. You think you're shy. You think you're shy. Shy. That sounds really weird when you say it multiple times on repeat. But anyway. Think you're smart. song um a whole album coming out soon you better watch your back johnny orlando <laughs> okay that's what i got so far and it's warning be prepared be prepared to be frustrated i've literally cried i've literally cried over songs before I, I'm like, dang, I can't get a tune, or dang, this is so frustrating, this song's getting annoying. If you love a movie, right, and you want to see it again for the first time, but you can never see that movie again for the first time, because you've already seen it. Ten people died in the Bronx last night due to a fire that killed ten people in the Bronx last night during a fire. Fire officials say all ten people died due to the fire, which was too hot for their bodies. Before I go, I just want to say it matters not what you've done, but what you do with what you've done for others. Well, with songs, it's, it's kind of like the opposite. I write a song. I, I really don't wish to write that song for the first time again, because it was so frustrating. So I move on to another song, and then it's the exact same process. You're frustrated, you're confused. Will people like this song? What is this tune? What am I doing? Am I a good singer? Am I gonna get anywhere? Will this be my future job? What if I fail at this? What will happen next? Like, you have so many questions like, <sighs> breathe, breathe. It's going to be okay. And even though it's, it's been like, uh, 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 
I've spent like 20 minutes on the song so far or something. Like this is what I got. You with the blurry eyes. You in a dark disguise. I see more than advertised. Think you're smart, but you recognize. Like I literally have a few seconds of a song. That's definitely not, definitely not a whole song right there. So, so the key is that it takes time. It takes practice, hard work, dedication, frustration. It takes mm. experience anger. I will literally throw my book on the ground. I will go outside for an hour, um, just sitting there and crying. I will just talk to myself. I will try to make myself feel better. Um, and an activity for that is uh, doodling or just simply writing down my thoughts because the weird thing is if you're having trouble writing a song and you get mad you leave this one song behind and you just go and relax but then you're like okay i can't find anything to calm me down so i'm gonna write down my feelings which leads to another song you just wrote down a song there and then the songs multiply so always write down your songs even a dream literally like i wake up sometimes and then I'm like, wait, okay, I'm just going to fall back to sleep for like five more minutes to finish this dream. And then, and then I'll be done. Like, just finish your dream, right? And then you wake up and I like to go on my phone video and I'm like, okay, so I just woke up, uh, but in my dream, blah, 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 blah. And it's sometimes like a 20 minute video of me explaining the whole dream. But that can definitely be used for uh, if you like writing stories or if you like writing songs. Um, but yeah. I know this is it's a long video for how to write a song this is just how i personally write my songs so i might actually title title this video not how to write a song mm. how i write a song i'm no expert at this so you should probably go watch tate's video um i'll try to link it down below um it's from a few years ago but literally look at her now Look at this beautiful woman. Like literally, mm, I love you so much, Tate. Hopefully, um, I really hope I'll meet you someday. You inspire me. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching. And on that note.